to go over to my brother's place tonight, but he and uh, his girlfriend just kind of want to chill. You know, just have a day to themselves, back to themselves, and that's fun. I was just watching, I'll show you which DVD I was just watching. Right? Something I definitely recommend for you guys if you are into, if you're really into wrestling and all that, and, and are just wrestling fans completely. And if you go to your local Walmart, you might just find this for ten dollars. What am I talking about? I'm talking about The Rock, the most le electrified man in sports entertainment. Three disc DVD set of just everything you can think of. Pretty much The Rock's entire life and wrestling career on these three DVDs already. The only problem I have with this set, though, is that they, they play a lot of the mainstream matches. Uh, the, the last two matches that The Rock ever had in WWE were uh, Rock vs. Goldberg and then The Rock vs. Mick Foley. Uh, Rock and Sock Connection against Evolution at WrestleMania 20. A lot of people don't realize that uh, those two matches were The Rock's very last two matches in WWE ever. And he hasn't wrestled since. He's made a few appearances or whatever, but he hasn't wrestled since then. Since Sunday, March 14, 2004. So realize that The Rock has had a wrestling career from Survivor Series 1996 to WrestleMania 20 in 2004. And that's only an eight year career, pretty much. Just about, pretty much about almost an eight, an eight year career in the WWE. And that's a long time. It may se it seems like a long time anyway. But uh, I definitely recommend this to you guys. I'm not going to really spoil anything that's in here. But uh, there's over... I think there's like over... 15 matches? Or 19 matches it says on here. And uh, I only watched the ones that I have seen before. There's a lot of uh, matches here that have been played before on other compilations and whatnot. But, uh, yeah, I do recommend it, though, if you're into wrestling, if you like The Rock. So, other than that, I don't really have a whole lot uh, to talk about, but tomorrow's vlog is going to be kind of interesting, because I'm going to, I read, I reread the comments, uh, on the few comments that I've been getting, and about what I should do with my videos while, while I'm not at home, or when I'm not working or whatnot, and one of the people said, one of the viewers said, do something based on your high school, like do some high school memories. So, what we're going to do, to what I've kind of decided that would be a good idea, is, as I dig to my closet here, we're going to go through my little history book here of, the, of my high school memories, and we're going to pretty much focus on my senior year. Senior year. <laughs> and we're going to focus on some things here. On like you know what school was like for me, and we're also going to play a tag game, meaning that I'm going to tag uh, a certain somebody to uh, express their school memories, whether they were fun memories or non-fun memories as well. You want to see what I looked like when I was in high school? Right here, er, right here, <laughs> right here. And this is when I was a little baby with my Grandpa Bushy who passed away here earlier this year. Does he look just like Waylon Jennings? You see? <laughs> but we're going to talk about that all tomorrow. And tomorrow's vlog. My high school memories, or my senior year in high school. And I'm also going to review a few secrets about me that you probably don't know yet. Trust me, they're not saying that are going to strike too much controversy, I don't think. <laughs> anyway, we'll see you tomorrow for high school memories on the Daily Summer Vlog, Frankie Salasson Show.